Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Gothic Night of the Raven. Now, before we begin, I just want to say I'm sorry to everyone who's watching my videos right now that I couldn't make any videos over the last week or so. It's basically because um, I've had heaps of school schoolwork to do and lots of assignments and all that random stuff. So I couldn't really make videos at that time, but now it's a holiday, so I'll probably be making more videos. So yeah, stay tuned and enjoy. So now, the thing we have to do is find this uh, temple area. Now, it's around here somewhere. Ooh, one second. Is this a... Yes, it is. What with? Oh no, but I don't have... Damn it, I don't have a focus stone. But anyway, there's another focus pedestal is over here. So if you have a focus stone, just use it there. Now, let's go here. Uh-oh. Oh, I hate these guys. Lizards and all. Oh, there it is. Just keep running. I don't want to die now. Oh, good. Oh dear. Uh oh. It, oh my god, it's a stone sentinel. I hate those things. But I know an easy way to kill them. There we go. Oh no. It's coming after me. There we go. That's the easiest way to kill a stone sentinel. Just slaughter it over into one of these corners and just attack. So, oh, we just found a ring, some potions. Let's see what else. Scrolls. Hmm, I'm low on health. I'm just going to use a health potion. And I think I should save... Oh, a black pearl. Very rare. I'm going to save. And then I'm going to kill all these stone sentinels. And then I'm going to reload again. Okay, after we've killed every single stone sentinel here and outside of there, let's try you open this chest. The right key. Huh. You need a key, eh? Maybe a stone Oh, there. I just checked some random stone sentinel and had the key. Well, I don't know if it's random for everyone, but it just killed... I think it's the first stone sentinel that awakens. Just check that stone sentinel and should have the key. Oh, cool. Two green stone tablets. Why are that? Oh, yeah. One for Franco and one for um, Satyrus to complete the uh, rare relics quest. Okay, let's go back to Franco. Here's the stone tablet. Good. Very good. Raven will be pleased with you. What about the camp now? Can I finally go in? No. I already sent Logan in. He was ahead of you in the list. And at the moment, there's no need for another man in the camp. Besides, I can really use you here. Now that Logan is here anymore. You swine. I'll get you. You miserable little wretch! You want to mess with me? Just you wait! Owned. Sorry, I just wanted to do that. Anyways, check Franco's body and he has a sword which you should keep. Franco's amulet. Now, this amulet is extremely good and use it all the time. Oh, take the green stone tablet back and some gold nuggets. Let's see. Now, put on that Franco's amulet. Damn. 
There we go. Cool. Now let's try and go inside. Hey, what happened down there? I flattened Franco. So, you did. I'd get yourself a pickaxe. Wow, I need a pickaxe to find that treasure. Anyways, we finally have entrance into the camp and it looks quite good. Not as bad as you think it is. Wow, quite impressive. Okay, let's go. Hey, are you the new guy who knocked on Franco? Hell yeah. Yes, why? Because now I have to take over his job. You did a great job. Thanks a lot. Wow. Ah, who have we here then? Looky, looky. There you are. Somebody tried to get Esteban out of the way. But he went to the bodyguards. Go to Esteban and talk to him. Afterwards, we'll talk again. Okay, Esteban is not far from here. Just located up this stairway. Hey! If you're looking it's for fisk. a decent trader here in the camp, then you just found him. My hut is right behind Esteban, so if you need anything, come on by. Oh yeah, just before we do anything, talk to Fisk again. Wait a minute. And trade. Show me your wares. Now, he's got some pretty cool stuff here. But one, uh, two things you might want to buy are two turnips. They will come uh, very handy in the quest in this uh, bandit camp. Now, Esteban, where is he? There we go. Talk to him. So you're the fellow who finds me in the camp, huh? Between them. That got around fast. Franco is a tough man. It's no secret. No one messed with him. No one. Except you. Just to make it clear, if you try the same shit with me, I want to get into the mine. Cushy deals to be in the right place for me. Because everyone who digs in the mine gets to keep a hefty share of the gold. And I hand out the red stones you need so that Thoris will let you in. Give me one of those red stones. Okay, but they aren't free. Normally I uh, demand a share of the gold the boys get for digging. <laughs> How much do you know about mining gold? You don't appear to know a whole lot about it. If I give you a redstone, it won't be because you're such a great digger. No. I have another job for you. What sort of job? One of the bandits planned to kill you should have known. But instead, my guards have killed him. He was hot for your job, huh? Yeah, he was hot out differently. He thought without a break. He never would have got the idea to attack me on his own. Nah. He was only fulfilling a contract. Someone else sent it. So, I'm supposed to find out who was behind it. Whoever sent me this assassin will pay for it. Find out. I can't I'm not sure I have a mind. Senyan sent me to you about this business. Senyan? He also works for me. I told him he should keep his eyes open. Okay, let's go back to Senyan. Oh, what the heck? Uh, I used the wrong side of my keyboard. Anyways, talk to him. Hey, you! I've talked to Esteban. And did he tell you about the attack? He ordered me to find out who sent the assassin. Do you know anything about that? No more than you do. I'm also on the hunt for the guy behind. And now we come to the interesting part. Let's hear it. I want you to do your job well. I want you to find the traitor. And when you have found him, I want you to kill him for me. Then I will pocket the reward. I have your wanted poster. Don't forget that. Do your job and do it well. You can figure out what will happen otherwise. I don't really have a choice. I knew we would come to an agreement. When you find out who the guy is, we'll kill the tick together. Now beat it. 
You know what you have to do. Yep, yes I do. Now, who would possibly know a lot about what goes around here? That would be the bartender. But before, oh, snap, the cook from Gothic One. Anyways, before we talk to him, let's talk to Lucia. And we can complete the long-awaited uh, quest. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Not much information from her, but at least we completed her quest. Now, uh, I'm gonna finish up here right now. But I'm gonna be making video just right after this, after I upload this video, so don't worry about me forgetting for a week or anything like that. So expect another video very, very shortly. So right now, see you later.